the order to pick up the pledge.
everything has the opportunity to be reviewed. I can't commit for any supervisor in the future. I'm not talking about supervisors in the future. I'm talking about what we're, we got on the table to vote for tonight. Let's submit 10 pages of concerns and questions or ideas. being the one that worked on that employee manual, um, I gave you very legitimate answers on all of your questions. Um, and I guess it's been two months since I originally brought this manual to the board. You gave me that 10 pages the morning of the last board meeting. I sent out all those questions to everybody and the answers and said, please come back with me if you have any questions or concerns, and this is the first I hear of it. I mean, I, I, I'm just confused, Frank. I mean, I, I want everybody to be okay with this. This had the blessing from our employment attorney. I worked well over a year on it, and for two months you've had me. And to, for us to adopt it tonight, just to have the board turn around and review it, maybe we don't agree with some of the answers.
And number three, I'd like to make a motion to appoint Dave DeMar as an alternate to the ZBA. Support. Any support? Any discussion? Uh, I'm Chilson for that replacement. Is he considered a business person? Uh, this is ZBA. This is, yeah, the zoning board. Oh, the zoning board. Yep. I don't nope. think it was something else. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Those letters are close. Yeah. All right. Simple motion, support. Dave DeMar. No discussion. All in favor say aye. 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 Both same sign. Aye. Someday you'll be my age. So. Comes the time again for public comment. Hearing none, I'll go to board comment. I have something to add when everybody's done. Any board comments? Hearing none, I received a message from Pam Ferris, a representative of the 48th District, <coughs> excuse me, in regards to what we call RRR funds. And it's a risk, I hate to use that word with me, uh, but it's RRR legislation, which is funds that are left over in a fund that each legislator has the opportunity to petition your particular road commission to utilize. Pam represents two different areas that we're familiar with and we were approved. This cost nothing to the taxpayers, although it's still taxpayer money. And the project will be the Farron Road Bridge over Pine Road Creek. If you're familiar with that road, be west of Linden Road. Uh, I was going to say on the south side, it's also on the north side. And that construction is going out for bids Tuesday, August 4th. It follows all the guidelines as any other construction. The project is bid out right now at approximately $1,400,000. That bridge is also one of the bridges that's been designated as being in sad state of disrepair. So uh, thank you, Pam Ferris, for getting something in our township that utilize the taxpayers' money, but at this particular time, does not come out of the inner townships. Any other public com or board comments right now? If not, thank you all for your time and service. Our next meeting is Monday, August 17th at 5.30, and we're going to adjourn. I got Nicole's for losing. I'm shocking to visit Road all the time. We just had a few drinks. It just can't be happening. Are we clear? Clear. We just buzzed. Just buzzed? You didn't tell us that, sir. You're right, this isn't happening. You'll be fine. Eh, I feel good. Really? No, not really. Buzz driving. Maybe we should stop acting like it's no big deal. Shocking.